One Owner Car Guy, OneOwnerCarGuy.com. And what I've got here for you today is a beautiful, huge 2008 Lincoln Limousine. It's a beautiful car. It's a 2008 Lincoln Town Car Limousine is what I should have said. Man, it's a stretch that just stretches on and on and on. This is going to be an exterior review, and I'm going to show you the outside of the car. Just anything there is to show you on that. And not a whole lot to tell you. There's fresh paint, fresh top on this car. It is clean. Um, interior, nice. Shifts, drives, brakes, stops, steers, and the whole thing. Just like it should. I'm going to go around it and show you just a quick once around like I'm doing now. And then I'm going to go in close right now and just show you anything wrong with it and such. And there ain't a whole lot to talk about when it comes to that end of it. My name's Nathan. It's 406 546 8748. You can reach me absolutely anytime. Um, I'm going to jump right in and do this. Make sure and subscribe down below. Click the little bell button to where you get notifications and such. And um, like my video and comment. Tell me something about it. Going around this car now. Underneath. It's clean. It's clean. Top is clean. Um, just going to go around a little water right there. And nice. Dings and dents. Dings and dents search. There ain't a whole lot to talk about on that. There just ain't. There's a water streak there because we just washed it. Um, and going down the side, it just looks good. Just looks good. It's a mosquito. See, he likes it. It's another one. Something on there. This, I think, is a little something right there, a little couple marks. Um, it's just in great shape. A couple tiny marks. And all the rubber seals are great. Chrome trim or whatever is pop metal or chrome trim, one or the other. It's in great shape. And the roof. The roof is in great shape. You got some radio up there blasting. I don't think it's clear enough to get some kind of thing though. Copyright claim, but I can hear music from the stop. Sorry about that. Hope everything's still good on your end. Everything up here is nice. It's just nice. Nice and clean. Now look, I got some. It's dirty. It's been sitting. It's been sitting, I tell you. Clean. 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 Clean the limo. Okay. That's walking around it. It's going down the sides. And there just ain't a whole lot to talk about. I'm going to go to a different place. A little ding right there. Tiny ding. Right there. And there's like little things round on the inside that you might tinker on. But this thing's got fresh little titties on the tires. Wheel wells look just nice as can be. I don't know what you would tinker around on this thing. Just clean. Mirror covers. Clean. Just clean. We've got a different kind of light here during this video. It's changed up. It's been... <laughs> Just made the sunset, man. Just made it. So it's a 2008. It's absolutely beautiful. There's... Hang on. Find the year here. I'm trying to make sure on the year. It's 2008. And I'm going to take you for a test drive. And I'll just show you the outside again at a different kind of light to where you can kind of see it. I'm going to do a whole separate review, which will be the interior. This thing's just so sweet. And it drives, it turns on a dime for what it is. At first it's like, oh man, this ain't going to be too fun to drive. Boy, was I ever wrong. That was nice. The interior review is going to definitely take a while. So I don't know who all you're planning to haul in your limo, but whomever, oops, I'm sorry, whomever it is that you're trying to haul in your limo will be just happy, comfortable, fresh, and ready to go in this limo. Um, actually, funny kind of deal, I picked my kid up from school in it, and that was funny. Actually, I've got... I've driven and had and done all kinds of unique Corvettes and Mercedes, BMWs, 
Ferrari cars and just you name it. I've never had a car that so many people point at. At school, so many kids are like, wow, there's a limo. This thing drives. It's a driver. Lincolns, you're floating on a cloud, man. They are made to run. Always been that way. They always rode just a little bit different than a Cadillac, you know? The Cadillacs had that nice ride, but the Lincolns were like riding on air. They really, really are just a nice ride. And this wheelbase kind of almost adds to it. Oh, my dinger for my seatbelt. I'll get that here. Okay, well, you're riding in it. You're seeing what it does. And it does it. And you want to put your foot on it and get down. It'll get down. It will get down. Popo -po there. I started worrying. <laughs> okay. I'm going to hop out here for the heck of it. I guess this is a long place I can park a long car like this. Give you kind of a different look. And then I'm going to go back and we'll start my interior video and do all that. Oh, this will work right here. Okay. So, caught a, caught a little bit more sun here to where you can really see what it looks like. Just a beautiful car. Runs, drives, steers, shifts, everything just like it should. I don't know anything bad to say about the car. I'll show you down the sides again. It's just plain. Like I say, the interior view is a whole different thing. You know, it's got AC in the back and it's got separate controls and stuff, partitions and things. I mean, this car is just set up and what can I say? It's a freaking limousine, right? Okay, I'm going to go back to my. I was going to go back to my yard where I do a lot of the staging, but there is this place where I take pictures. And it's not so far from here. So I think we're going to skedaddle around Mr. Beamer here. He's sitting there looking at me. What's he doing? What's he doing? I'm working, son. I'm working. Move on over. We're looking for a ride. Actually, Gunner went to pick this up at the, uh, we had a painted, uh, new paint job, the paint shop, and um, I told one, dude, come on now, if you pull, if you pick anybody up, you're splitting the fare with me. You just drive around and make some money with this, Uber, Uber Ultra Black or something, I don't know. Um, and like I say, you can see, look at that hood. Nice, shiny new paint job. Um, it's not the most awesomest tin of a, show quality put them on the rob report you know i mean you might find a little something but you're gonna have to look pretty hard for you to not like it um, it's nice shiny new and is used good to paint um, so that's where we are okay so i'm gonna clip right down this road here and then we're going to show you just a little bit more of this car now if you're interested in the car give me a call my name's nathan it's 406-546-8748. You can reach me absolutely anytime. That ding, ding, ding. Oh, man. If you're annoyed, then put your seatbelt on. Okay. Okay, I will. I'm just sitting here. So you've got all my contact information. You know that if you're not subscribed to this channel, you just need to. Check out my channel. There is so many other cars there. You'll just be so amazed. I'm telling you. Whether it's old classic Mercedes or old classic Cadillac or a old classic Japanese car. I got some old classics. I got some newer classics. I got all kinds of cars. I got all kinds of cars. Okay, well, you know, I either talk too much or I don't talk enough in these videos. This one's bordering on the talk too much because I didn't have a whole lot to talk about. And, duff, with the change of the time, I almost didn't get any sun pictures. You wouldn't imagine how close I got to missing my day pics. But, got them. It's the second limo I've done uh, the same amount of weeks. I've got four limos. Check my website. They're all different. It's not all Lincolns. The other one was a Mercedes S500. It was nice. This is nice. I actually prefer the Lincoln, which I can't believe I'm saying. Okay, there we go. Okay. Let's get out. Do this to this. And show you... What we got, say goodbye and 
all that good stuff. Look at that. Just look at that. Yeah, it is, it is beautiful. I'm going to back it up a little bit, though. Okay, that's your exterior review. Thanks for watching. They're Mitchell and Tires, too, baby. <whistles> nice set of shoes. Okay, that's that. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. Whatever it is, wherever you are, oneownercarguy.com. And subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. We'll talk to you. One Owner Car Guy, oneownercarguy.com. And what I've got here for you today is the interior video of this beautiful 2008, 2008 Lincoln Town Car. It's in great shape. I just had to check my phone because it's on a split month there, like six, where it could have been a 2009. I wasn't sure. Just wanted to make sure, tell you exactly what we're looking at. Absolutely beautiful car that I forgot that I had to do pictures of while I was up here too, start doing my video. I'm going to do it once around, kind of show you the once around to where you can see just what a big long stretch limousine you are looking at. And then I'm going to, I already did the up close and showed you everything outside and everything like that. And this will be an interior video showing the amenities, the options, and all that kind of stuff of the inside of this limo. So that's that. You can call me, Nathan, you can call me anything you want. Just call and buy it. Nathan, it's 406 546 8748. Reach me anytime. And that's about that. Make sure to subscribe, like the video, comment, talk to me about it. Something like that, you know. And that's about all I'm going to say. So I'll jump in, show you under the hood and stuff. I'm going to pop it, and then we'll start looking inside and get to moving. All right, I popped the hood, so here we go. And no, it doesn't just magically pop. Pop. I opened the door and did that. So here you go. Look at that motor. One of the most reliable, best running, awesome, long lasting power plants that's ever been made. This limo is a town car, man. It's a service body, it's a service engine. It was made to be the luxury cars and the police cars and the taxi cabs of the world. And they did a good job for a heck of a long time. This thing's so clean, it's even got all the stickers on everything still. Just awesome to see something in this good of shape. And these are going away, these are getting to be rare to find in this kind of shape, even the hood insulation, hood padding is just in great shape. So as you can see, under the motor, beautiful, under the motor, yeah, under the hood, just in great shape. And with that, I'm going to show you the inside and everything and try and get to a different area to where we can do it there. I might actually do the test drive first. I like that idea, I do. Just going to hop in it and we'll test drive it down there. I got some battery going out on my camera, so I'm trying to conserve. Actually, I'll show you the partition here. Hang on. There we go. So there's that. Pull that down. And of course, all your other windows work fine. I was putting them back up and trying to steer with one hand there. I'm sorry. So windows and all that are good. Yeah, buddy. It's got plenty of get up and go. There's actually a church over here I do some pictures at that I wanted to snap a few in this sunset type time to see just what we came up with. And I have test drove this in the other video. And I actually drove this um, to L, uh, LA from Anaheim and then to San Diego from LA. And stinking drove great. You got a lot of car to get in a turn behind you. Don't forget that. Take your turns wide. But overall, it's a very easy car to drive, um, which is cool. And I think I'm gonna go back a different way. That'll help me get a better video. My time is just, my battery is dwindling, I guess you, that's what I'm trying to say here. There's just a little picture I wanted to get in this one, in this parking lot. At this time, other than that, we'll get back on the road and then I'll start getting to showing you the inside. Okay, well that accomplished what I wanted. Auto locking doors and such. 
by the way, there's that window going down and up. And there's that one going down and up. So, you got that. You got that on your side, I'm telling you. So the external or interior options are all working. The extremities, the options, uh, whatever you want to call it. I can't get over how smooth it rides. Sometimes if you got a dually pickup, that thing will just tap, 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 down the road. And then you hit them grooves in the road, it'll rumble and throw you all over. And that's just in a crew cab dually pickup. This thing's got a lot more length to it, but it seems to be the length that just kind of smooths that ride out because it rides nice. And I'm gonna turn here where we can get a little bit of 4550 back on the back road. I don't know what else to say offhand. Um, everything pretty much goes to it. You got all kinds of controls here. Um, all your options are good. Yes. Your seats are beautiful. I've got my not for hire and stickers here. These are just in great shape. Look at that. I'm gonna do this. We can go forward. We can go backward. Down in the front. Wait. Up in the front. Now down in the front. Now up in the back. Now down in the back. Now the back. Now up. So there's every way for you on that seat. I'll show you the one I'm on when we get out. Just figured might as well use my time prudently and wisely at the stoplight there. And we did that. So, we're just like Willie now. We are truly on the road again. Shifting, everything on this car is just nice. I don't know of anything that there is to actually fix on it. It's just mechanically sound. Seems to have been very well maintained. And shiny, nice, and beautiful as can be. I usually go the other way here. In fact, I just did the exterior review down here. Give you a little bit of sound there to where you can hear it. And I'm going to slow down. Roll the windows down, let this guy pass to where he can do his thing, and then I'm gonna wind it up for you again and take off from a stop. Now I'm not flooring it, I'm just giving it some juice, and there's 40, just like that, so right to the speed limit. That's another thing, it's not slow, it's a lot heavier than a normal car of this caliber and such. But this car is in no way slow. This car is quick. And I'm almost back here. Wow, there's going to be United Rentals over here. Huh, cool. Yeehaw, buddy. Another car review down. Check my channel. There's stinking 8,000 videos I have online. I was looking and counting through channels and stuff. And 8,000 videos? That's a lot of videos, dude. It is. Check some of them out. I got other limos and classics and maybe. Now, the real classics. Oh, man, look at this. Here we are. This is like a, a museum. Right when you come in. There you go. You like Lincolns? Lincoln Mark 7 with 26,000 miles. Chevy Astro van. Range Rover 4.6 SH HSE in the P38 edition, man. A square body Ford here. Here's a Mercedes limo. Told you I had one. I wasn't lying. I wasn't lying. Okay, I climbed out. Here's your key fob, keychain. Put that in here for now. And I'm going to put the... The light makes a lot of difference if you've been able to see stuff. Door panel, great condition. I threw my paperwork down there. Let me try and... Never even knew to open that. No idea. That pedals. I don't even know where, man. It's in great shape. I don't have a... Um, format in here. A little bit of wear along the edges here. Just discoloring a little bit. Um, not wore through and all crappy or nothing. It's in great shape. Headliner's in great shape. All of this stuff is all good as it should be. It's all good in the hood. Dash is in good shape. Let me do you these. 
to where you can see back forward down in the front up in the front up in the back down in the back up in the back recline unrecline it's all there cup holders armrest tags ashtray and such well is that on a hydraulic type of a it did it kind of shot down to the floor books are in there um, let me show you in the back here real quick whoo buddy door panels great condition look at these seats they're great it's a little bit of fold over I like to call it it's not really anything you just get dirt in the little seams the only thing it even closely resembles a hole is a little pinhole right there um, but just in good shape clean Got little things back here pull this down oh cool and this will go through to the back Velvety. Ooh, that's a nice velvety headliner. Uh, we're going to have to fire this thing up, aren't we? Sure am. Let's just show you the condition of everything. And then let me get up here. Ooh, I wonder. I can. Oh, that's a long ways, buddy. I didn't know, remember, I put it all the way down there. I'm getting too old for this. Just getting way too old for this. That'd be embarrassing. Pretty tight fit for me, dude. Get stuck in there. Okay. You need lots of liquor if you're gonna have this. Lots of liquor. Well. Wow. Good all back there, don't it? That thing was flipping around. So, trying to get something out of it. Makes me wonder if I should check and not give you the CD. I don't know what that is. What is that? Looks like a DVD player, yes sir. You know, it ain't ejecting that disc. There is MP3 nowadays anyways. Okay, so let's just tell you that we don't think that works. Because I don't wanna tell you it does and it don't. Not that. It's got a CD stuck in it. Almost guaranteed. One of those straws. Then you got another one of these little cubby hole things. Over here. Jeez, really? All the way back here. Oh, it goes all the way back. That's why, look at that, rolls all the way back. Bet you this one. No, but it goes all the way back here too, buddy. Trash can? Yes. That would be your trash can. It's got this up here. The window tinting is kind of messed up on that side just a little bit. Um, AC back here, the whole deal, man. Let me get up. Man, I'm just clicking all the wrong things on my phone. I think this is like a saddle strap, yeah. And it comes right off. These move also, nice and heavy. Um, you've got your thing there, and this will turn up the fan, and it really goes too, buddy. I'm not kidding, this is the privacy things, and there it goes. Interior lights. You've got these. that button bar oh yeah it just hit up lights in the bar oh and it hit up top too Any things in here somewhere kind of cool it comes on in stages 
It does, huh? I'm clicking them. It won't set. It'll get brighter. Let me close this. There we go. Huh, that's cool. If you close that. It goes through the dim and the bright of it. I don't even know what that one does. Oh, right there. At the top lights. Uh, and that's that, okay. So you've seen that. Now this one is not opening the top. It does have these mirrors and stuff. It seems to work. There you go. We just hadn't been open in so long that they weren't working. Okay, you have seen it all, bud. That's all there is to say about it. You have seen it all. You've seen it in the light, in the dark. You've seen it. Okay, well, that's that. I'm getting out of here, and I'm going to give you an outro and say goodbye. I wanted to say, too, the steering wheel is in pretty good shape. It's just nice with this cushy pad on it. Just a little bit of wear on it. Side airbags and the seats and whatever. It's a safe car. Okay, there's a kicker square sub in the trunk, baby. You got an amp in here somewhere because it thumpity thumps. Um, you got controls for it and everything down below. He's got some cool stuff in here to keep track of everything. Nice, good sp Wow, I don't know if that's been on the road. But it's in clean, clean shape. That's your trunk. I don't know where I threw this in. I just wanted to throw it in somewhere. And auto sucked down. I put a new latch on that thing. Um, and on this side, I'm going to show you this. It's just beautiful. And pull out the books and show you any records I have and such. Um, as a matter of fact, let's do this in the back. All kinds of stuff for all the Clarion and Sony and all your audio box, your speakers and all that stuff. You've got all these books. you got your factory books. Everything is in here. But not only that, not only do you have all this cool stuff I'm saying. Hang on one sec. And it's a crystal coach, baby. A crystal coach. That's a heck of a limo. Look at that. Got your actual limousine manufacturer paper. I want to show you this. You got the actual window sticker to the truck. 15 a car. 15 and 22. And they added a lot more options than that. But that's your deal. Crystal Coach, baby. Any of these other beautiful cars you see, you're like, look, man, we got SL500s and 750ILs and Lantes and Corvettes and you name it. There's all kinds of convertible Mustangs and just all kinds of stuff around here. Old classic pickups you've seen over there we got another limo and this is your lincoln town car so thanks for watching have a great day or night whatever it is wherever you are oneownercarguy.com check out my channel for all kinds of other videos and if you're interested in this one call me up 406-546-8748 thanks for watching have a great day or night we'll talk to you